The other thing you're going to run into a lot with uh, live sound reinforcement is a variety of different kinds of cables and connections. Let's take a look at those. This is what we call an XLR cable. There is a female and a male version of this. An XLR cable is in a balanced cable, meaning that it has three or two conductors and a shield. This is a quarter inch connector, but it is a what they call a TRS. Notice that there is three separate contacts here, and the contacts are separated by this little black ring. This would also be a balanced cable. Now this cable, we had mentioned, indicated a balanced connection, but not always. It has to be like this on both ends for it to be balanced. This one is actually a non-balanced cable. It has a tip ring sleeve, so it's TRS on this side, but on the other end of the cable it splits to two-quarter inch. Now, what that means is that the tip of this side is coming to the gray, it says tip right there, and the orange is the ring, is this portion here. This is used commonly to inject a uh, side chain or effects processor or something into a specific channel in your mixer. These are what are called RCA connectors. These are typically used out of the back of your CD player and into the mixing board will usually have a couple of ins and outs for these. This is usually how you get from consumer audio into pro audio. You will also run into a lot of quarter inch, standard quarter inch connectors and this would be a non-balanced cable. It only has one conductor and one shield and you can tell that because of the configuration here. This is a speak on cable and it is becoming more and more popular all the time. What it is is uh, a connection that goes from a lot of amplifiers now, it used to be more rare, but most amplifiers and speakers have this type of connection in the back for the power out from the amp to the speaker. It's got a ring and when you shove it into the receptacle you twist it and it locks in. And This is what we call a banana plug. With the banana plug you take a screwdriver and you back the screws out here, you strip the ends of your uh, speaker wire and you put the ends through the hole that is left here, screw it back in, and then there will be a spot on the back of your amplifier where you can plug this onto the red and the black side. The nice thing about banana plug is they can stack. So once you put this one into your amplifier, you could put another one just like this right into the back.